Oh, he's coming over, guys. He's coming. Look at that big boy. Boshkar, can you come up? Up, up, up. Look how big he is compared to me. Big cats. They are excited. They know something's going on and that they're getting a treat. This is a serious job because if any of these doors are open, it's not good for me. What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. As you guys can see, we are here today with the cats. It's Thanksgiving tomorrow and these cats are getting a big turkey. Well, we have a turkey for the big tiger over here and then we have another turkey for the lion pride over there. You guys are just gonna have to watch and see as we go, but look, Right here, we have this beautiful golden tabby tiger. Now, guys, I don't know if you guys have the chance to get close to big cats, but don't do this, what I'm doing. I'm friends with these animals. I know what I'm doing. So don't get close to big cats because you're probably gonna get hurt unless you know what you're doing. Over here, we have a royal and a snow tiger. Now, tigers come in three different color variations. We don't have a standard tiger here, which is that regular orange and black color pattern that you see on the frosted flakes box but look at these beautiful girls and boys right here they are just amazing and i can't wait to give them their treats all right guys so we have our turkeys right here look at these beautiful birds are you guys ready for thanksgiving now obviously not going to mess with these guys these are our beautiful turkeys here at zwf Look at these big males. We also have some beautiful emus here. Look, come here. These guys are true dinosaurs. If you look at their feet, those talons look just like a velociraptor from Jurassic Park, like something you've never seen. Beautiful, beautiful animals. But actually, just kidding. We're not using these turkeys. We're gonna have to head over to Walmart and get ourselves some turkeys. All right guys, so we are at the Walmart now and I really don't know if they're gonna have any turkeys, so we're just gonna have to see. It is the day before Thanksgiving, so we're gonna go look now. We have to put our masks on, so it might be hard to understand me, but let's go see if there are any turkeys for these big cats. So we have the turkeys here, guys, and I think I'm gonna get two of these big guys. So we got that one right there, and then, I don't know, I guess, maybe this one's nice and juicy right here. At the truck now, we've got our two turkeys right here. So we're just gonna get them like this. We're gonna put them back here. And now we are ready to head back to the zoo. These are the two turkeys here now. They are a little cold, but I think they should be all right. But we can't forget stuffing. Who has Thanksgiving turkey without stuffing. So I figured I would stop by my house on the way home or on the way back to the zoo and get some chicken chips from Live Positive, my mom's company. You guys know what it is. I don't have to spiel about it for a long time. Go check out the website. If you have a dog or a cat, wanna check out some dog treats, cat treats, cat food, whatever, go check it out. It's awesome. So anyway, we are going to be stuffing the turkeys with this. And I think Boshkar is really going to enjoy that. Now Boshkar is another golden tabby tiger. He is just beautiful. He's huge. He's about maybe 280 pounds. Just a beast of a tiger and he is going to be getting one whole stuffed turkey with these treats that we got here. So we got to get that set up for him and we'll see you inside the cage. Now look at all these big cats. They are excited. They know something's going on and that they're getting a treat. So we're gonna open this up right here. I might even give some to you guys. I planned on giving this whole thing to Boshkar, but we're just gonna have to see who all gets treats here at ZWF today. Guys, I am at ZWF Miami. Come check it out if you are in town. Wow, this thing is really hard to open. Two hours later. Now look at that beautiful Thanksgiving turkey. Woo! That looks tasty. And hopefully tomorrow all of us will be able to enjoy some turkey like this. I mean, this is human grade stuff. You saw, we went to the store, just got it as I would be getting it for my family. I'm gonna take off one of these turkey legs here just like this, try not to get it too dirty. We got our two legs 
over here. Now those are gonna be for our special girls over there that you guys are gonna have to see in a minute. This girl's getting excited over here. Let's try to break off some skin for her. Hey, hey, come up, 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 up. Be very easy, very easy. Look how big that cat is, not even full grown. Now if I was to film putting a turkey in here with these guys, they would fight and it just wouldn't be good. But you can see over here, turn around, Boshkar is ready to go. He smells that turkey and he says, it's Thanksgiving and I want to eat. Look at that big boy. Boshkar, can you come up? Up, up, up. Look how big he is compared to me. That is a massive tiger right there. Golden tabby tiger. You can see he has those amber-like colors, more of, kind of like a strawberry blonde type hair pattern. What's up, big boy? Who's a big boy? He smells that turkey on my hands. Let's get Boshkar his Thanksgiving turkey. So we are in Boshkar's cage right now. We're gonna set up his turkey right here. We're gonna open this. So we got our stuff here. We're gonna stuff the turkey just with some chicken hearts. This is that good organ meat. Just for some additional flavor. Put a couple pieces up there that spilled out. We're gonna stuff it like that and I think that this turkey is good to go. Boshkar is ready to go, so we're gonna get out of this cage. Now we are gonna get Boshkar out. Boshkar, go get your turkey. He's gonna smell it. He smells it on my fingers. We have to lock this lock out. He's smelling it, he's smelling it. He's smelling around, he said, what did they do in here? I think it's up here. Oh yeah, look at that, guys. Look. He's smelling it. He says, this is a good Thanksgiving to me. Now, Boshkar will eat through all of those bones. Nothing is gonna go to waste. That turkey will probably disappear in, I don't know, it depends on how long he wants to sit and play with it. Boshkar is working on his turkey right now. We're gonna let him work on that, and then we are gonna go right now and feed the lion pride a big turkey. We are here at the beautiful lion cage. Now, I don't think I have shown you these white lion females yet or that beautiful white lion male. That is Kunto back there. He is the king of this pride. And these girls are just absolutely beautiful. They smell that turkey too and they're excited. Now in the wild, females would do most of the hunting. He would kind of sit back and protect the pride protect the babies while these girls would be hunting, getting that food. They'd bring it back to him and the males would eat first. Generally, the male is gonna eat around 16 pounds a day where the females will eat around 10 to 11 pounds on average, but they wait their turn, they give their food to the male out of respect and they keep hunting and being the killers that they are. They mostly hunt at night, but today we're giving them some food for Thanksgiving. So let's get these girls, we're gonna have to give them these turkey legs from earlier. Now they are a little dirty. Doesn't really matter for them. So they say, I don't really care. That's just extra flavor. That's just some salt and pepper, but we're gonna clean it up a little. And then we're gonna get them over there so we can give Kunto his big Thanksgiving turkey. So in order for these cats not to fight, we're gonna have to shut this behind me. Now, this is a serious job because if any of these doors are open, it's not good for me. So we're gonna have to go over here we're gonna put one right here. So these big girls are in here. The one already finished her meal, and now this one is working on her chicken, which means we just have to get the big male into this cage to get that cage empty and set up his Thanksgiving turkey. Guys, now before we give this big boy his turkey, look how big those teeth are. You can see the hooks on the back of his tongue. If I play that in slow motion, you can see those hooks right there. Those hooks are meant to lick the flesh and really rip it apart. If he was to lick my skin, after a couple licks, it would cut right through and it would really go down to bone. So we have Kunto in his lockout now. Again, white lion, just like the females. Now white lions are Basically, just like any standard lion, they just lack that darker pigment in their fur. There aren't many of them in the wild because they're not able to camouflage and blend in as well. But look how beautiful they are. That golden mane, these blonde beauties, just amazing big cats. And he, I can tell, is excited for his treat. So we're gonna go over there, 
go in his cage, stuff that turkey, and see what happens. We've got all those cats situated. Now we are going into the lion den, the lion cage. We gotta get our keys here. Now again, guys, opening this cage is a serious thing. And luckily, I have experience doing it. If I didn't, I wouldn't be doing this. That's how accidents happen. And that's how these animals get put to blame for human error. It's really not their fault. They don't really know. And if they were to see me, they would probably play with me more than anything. They don't want to kill me. They don't even know what I am. Ever since they were little, they've been raised with just playing with people. But they don't know how big they are. They don't really understand how powerful they are. And obviously, us versus them, we're no match. We've got our big turkey here. We're gonna have to get this plastic out because anything that goes into this cage becomes the king's. I have to get this leaves off of here. Now what I do want to do, I'm gonna set this up right here so I can get a clear shot of him eating this through the cage. So our turkey's ready to go for him. We're gonna get out of the lion cage because the longer we're in here, the more chance for something to happen. We're gonna come over here and lock this up and release Kunto. I'm gonna walk around. I'm not sure if you guys are gonna be able to see me over there. Sam's gonna stay here on the bird. We're gonna let Kunto out and hopefully he comes right here and eats this turkey right in front of you guys so you can see just how much he enjoys it and the power that he has in those jaws and in those teeth. Are you guys ready? Let's go big boy, let's go. coming over guys he's coming look at that he might take it over and take it away look at that guys oh yeah he is munching on it so I ran around and look at this Kunto is crunching down on his turkey now that's just a small meal for him really but a really special treat for him on Thanksgiving. We like to do special things like this because it's really good enrichment for these animals. Something new, it's a little different than the chicken that he's getting on his day-to-day -day basis and look how much he's enjoying it. He's out here just crunching down on all those big turkey bones. It's really, really fun for him and something new like this for him just brings a little more excitement to his day, which is what we're all about here at ZWF Miami. Please check out the zoo if you can. I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as Kunto and Boshkar are enjoying their turkeys. If you guys are not subscribed yet to the channel, please subscribe, leave a like, throw a comment down of what your favorite part of today's video was, and I will see you guys in the next adventure. Peace.